Oh shit, yeah, I fucked genius. up. I, I yeah, did. you did. I wasn't displaying the right overlay. Sorry, guys. Oh. So oh, okay, so right that I'm looking at this depot from SCRVN and I'm like scratching my head. I'm like, yeah. why put it there? That's like the least helpful spot. Dude, that's how they do it in Vietnam, dude. You don't know about that meta. I guess so, like Vietnamese meta. Well, yeah. Let's see. I mean, this could go anywhere. So, so can I tell you what I'm easy. thinking? Can I, can I just give yeah, you... Yeah, right, go on. Can I sort of go set on, the scene on. here? I well, love... What was your game plan? Tell me that much. Well, I love ZVT. Um, I... <laughs> I thought that... I mean, I studied my opponent. I was very wary of the mech stuff, so I was ready to say mm. if I see any gas or mech stuff, I'm going to do the a Ling Hydra all in, which I did practice. Um, shout okay. outs to Avi Love and uh, Zergs on my team. But he is a bio player, so it didn't end up working out that way. But I'm still confident ah. playing against SK. Um, I like CB. I thought on Whiteout, I was a little bit rough. Like I, I wasn't sure how to play Whiteout to its full. You know, effect, but then we. Oh, well, we're not in white out now. We're on circuit breaker. I know. So, honestly, I was just going to play him straight up and sort of give him a read. I knew that he was like a C level Terran. So, that's pretty much all that I knew. Okay. Well, yep. you're going for pretty conservative. Pretty and by the way, I don't have any true preference over mutas or lurkers as a Zerg player. I like to do both. So. Oh, uh, true neutral. Yeah. True neutral. Yeah. Hey, does that depot interfere with gas mining? I, I want to... You're the Terran again. Should we take a well, screenshot? You normally just don't <laughs> screenshot. do that. Like, <laughs> it might be like that thing Protoss do where they put the cyber and it's like just right, but mm -hmm. why would you want to put it there? Like, it's just going to block meters. Maybe I'm he's nervous. Marines trying to catch meters, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, maybe he is. I mean, you know, I always harp on building plays, but that's like my, my bug bear, Dude, I guess. But Jaeger bomb's pretty good. I won't lie. Okay, I got a question in this hatchery position from HSC. Um, I'm okay. just gonna put it further away. So I, one scan I know, Nebulim, and I do that against you. I just yeah. I have a ten. I have that. a tendency to neglect my third hatch when it's not in my mm. F2 camera position, which is really bad. <laughs> and I'm a noob, right. so I just told myself I'm gonna put it close on this. Oh, one. ad hoc says this depot is legit because it speeds up the bottom SCV pathing. Okay, that's pretty cool. They but... both help. Okay. But is it a better advantage than putting it so that the finishing SCVs pop out closer? I'm not sure that it is. I don't know. I might be wrong about that. But that's interesting. I didn't know that. Dude. So, yeah, maybe you're right about this Vietnamese meta bringing in these building Bro, yeah, right? See. Get on that Vietnam All right, I think level. we're going to see uh, eBay first here, by the way, from uh, CRVN. So, looking like he's probably going to go for some bio play, at least to begin with. Um, nice depot placement there. Could be further back. But still setting up all the sort of defensive uh, you know, landmarks, I guess. I have a uh, drone not mining at my nap. Oh no. Are you Better fucking kidding game. me? Oh, oh I see it. God. He's pretending though. He's like slacking. He didn't want to work very hard, so he just kind of walked out of the minerals, held out his claws, like, oh yeah, boss, I'm mining. Don't mind me. This is the you first. Know, the, the Overlord flies okay. over, has a look, and like, yeah, he's mining. I'm not sure with your new Australian internet if you have my stream up on another tab, but I just did the face I palm. Can, yeah. Okay. Well, I have the chat, but I don't turn the stream on unless I. That's fine. I guess I might as well. I'm if it's muted, I'm you telling know, that's you. Yeah. I just did the first face palm of many a face palm in this game, I think. Yeah, so I'm looking at this, and I was just about to say your hydrogen is going to be late, but I guess it's down pretty much just on time. Uh, so we're going to see Lurker play. I mean, against uh, three hatch Lurker, okay. Mm -hmm. I would prefer to be like Turex Academy if I'm against Lurker. Maybe that's just a preference thing, and obviously you can't like know yeah. that before you commit to which path. That said, mm -hmm. like, it's not like eBay first is bad or anything. That's just my personal preference. Mm -hmm. But you do have to get out there, and it can be a bit scary before the science whistles out. There's a lot of avenues for Zerg to be sneaky and, like I say, ambush you. And you've right. got to have really good micro and stay on top of your bio. Actually, um, so the build looks pretty solid from this. Hey, yeah. I remember my plan. Um, it was yeah. going to be three hatch lurker into crazy Zerg ultra with carapace okay. upgrades. Yep. Yeah, I like it. Because if you keep those lurkers alive, they are really strong engaging with the ultras as well. Yeah. All right, well, you're going to need a third and fourth base for that. Oof. Ah. Oh, I'm going to take a third. Oh, I'm getting a third, man. You yeah. know, just you wait, man. I'll let you again. You do your thing, bro, because I know, no, okay. it's, I know it's what's up here. It's the Adam Barracks. Uh, scans will be coming down relatively soon. Unfortunately, he's getting a CV who didn't stay around for very long, so not much intel, really. In mm -hmm. fact, I think it's a bit risky of a CV and not to have a bunker here. You could have gone for a Lingolin, and that would have been pretty devastating. 
Uh, medics and stim are out though. Uh, and I assume as soon as he scans the uh, hydrogen, get out of the map. Oh, okay, this detail interests me. I don't know how I feel about this. Because there is lurkers, like both these depots are in considerable threat, and you don't really. Yeah. I mean, it helps against Lings. I mean, if it's Muta, this is kind of going to be helpful, I guess. Except at the same time, doesn't it block Marines? I don't yeah. Know. I I saw this and I just thought, well, I know he's going bio, so that's really all I was thinking about. Well, yeah, but there's always the switch, right? When you open five ranks, it's it's very uh, I don't know, germane to switch from that. You know what I mean? Did uh, you? What did you say? Germain, like it, it, it's cognitively smooth. Germain? Yeah. That is real. That's like some SAT vocab there, bro. Well played. I actually. We don't have SATs in Australia. I res so. oh, okay, yeah, American bias. That's that's we like have standardized. HSCs. That's the standardized. That's some good standardized testing vocab there. Okay, well, props, props for you know pointing yeah. out my vocab prowess, but that, I was really trying to express it the best way I could. Um, yeah. it, it, I guess I could just say it's easy. How's that? You yeah. like that better? Hey, I mean, I just I think it's cool. Oh. Yeah. So, um, yeah. I didn't see if he scanned, because I was kind of distracted by that. Um, but he is moving out here, so I assume he knows it's not me list, because there's no target again, so he must have scanned it. Uh, I'm used to there's only three racks, and then straight to factory. But I think we're going to see that, like, three tank timing push off this. I think that's what you do when you get three racks. Or it's going to be some, like, kind of tech transition. I'm not really sure. I'm not familiar really with, like, three racks type plays. I am kind of scared of, like, this small amount of Marines out here, but there's no Hydras on this ramp! I know. Jesse, what are you doing? I'm make. I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> did he past. not see it? No, he sees it. Yeah, this base oh, is dead. I was aware. This is dead. Yep. You should cancel, honestly, because there's no way you can save I, this. I totally should cancel. Indeed, I did. Oh, nice. Nice. Let me see. Just, and I start making it 12. It. I started making okay. it 12. Yep. Okay, fine. Oh, Ooh, oh lag. Oh, by the way, his drop screen kept appearing there. So oh dear. he was lagging in a quite serious way. Like I thought, Unfortunate. I thought maybe he was going to drop, but my internet is not okay. Can, can <laughs> we just? Can I just highlight that a little bit here? That okay? I just want to say Ooh, nice split. Just want to say Loka. very nice. Yep. Getting the value he can out of this trapped fire. Yep. I mean, it's really nice so far. I, I like that he's actually going to get like two or three lurkers for his trouble and splitting as well, which is not easy to do under high latency conditions. You got to even cross with that. He's out of scans now. Uh, I'm afraid their value wasn't an end, but he did his best. Yep. Um, so we don't see a science facility yet, which is a big problem. Like, when you're going this eBay first style, you really got to get those vessels out. Yeah. Um, and I would like to see more barracks as well. Like, I feel like we could afford more production here. Tech's a good defensive asset, but I don't see how he's going to be able to extend it on the map without using the star port tech and getting a lot more buff. Like, I'm foreseeing that our hero, Chess Z, uh, yes. will be able to get a fourth base relatively hassle-free if SCLVN <sighs> continues on this trend. Yeah, yeah, you know, you would think, if you think that, you, you're right. Um, what ends up happening is something a little bit different, but Chessie, you know. don't go in there. Why are you going in there? I don't know, dude. I Why? thought it might be good. Well, there is no vessel, so he has to wait for scans on this. Which is kind of, it's full energy, is natural. I think maybe he didn't have that whole key, or isn't utilizing that fully. Oh. Yeah, these depots, man. I'm not sure about these depots. They do yeah. help against links and stuff. If the lurks are trying to like run full in there, they help. But like, I think they're just a liability most of the time. I don't know. This tank's crushing it, though. And it yep. will be out soon. A bit Oof. late on the vessel timing, but he is quite prompt with his third CC here. Again, I would like to see more racks. I think he just needs more bioproduction. Dude, I'm like... Uh, I mean, well, hype is out. I'm so. doing pretty good. Like, I'm at good APM. I've got good infrastructure. But your third gas is not operational yet. I know. So... I know, I'm gonna get I'm there. Not, not a criticism of your play, more a criticism of the position you're in. I feel like you're not at a good advantage at all because your third base is only just starting. In theory, Terran's gonna be able to extend out here with the science vessel. Yeah. But look at my vision, dude. Zone, look, so look at this vision. Yeah. Beautiful. Very nice vision. Shout out to Fox. What about Overlord hiding in yeah. SCRVN's base? Yeah. You like it? Yeah. Ooh, it's do, do. Second eBay a bit late for SCRVN. Finally, another barracks coming down. He's going into Vultures right away, so uh, maybe we'll see him next switch here, but he's already committed to a second eBay, so that doesn't seem likely or possible even, really. Um, maybe he's just going to mix in the mines, which is quite good. Uh, especially if it turns out to be Ultralist, like you were saying you wanted to go. Yep. Um, but you do go for the Defile amount, which I think makes sense in this because you're already a bit on the back foot, so you need to just defend. I, think I did, yeah. yeah. But I felt that way, face. yeah. Uh, you can see that he has his third, right? Yes. So, 
Terran can pump out a lot of Marines. If you're not careful. Oh, yeah. he sees the Overlord. He finally he sees, sees my Ovi. Yeah, yeah. He sees no, he's it. just gonna run into the base though. It's fine. <laughs> oh. oh, wow. Man, the boy who lived. The boy who lived. Oh, wow. Rex. Wow. Oh no, he's gonna die. The boy who died. Okay, so that's a lot of scourge you have up there at the twelve. By the way, are you anticipating a big doom drop? I mean, I often just make a lot of Scourge, and then I'll slowly separate them, divide them, clone them for vessels, and, uh, you know. I want about eight or so on the map at least right now, just in case, because yeah. he's got three so, vessels, and he could drop me too. Yeah, my prediction right now is the vessel count's going to continue to grow, and uh, I don't think Chessy slash you, I don't know if I can call you or Chessy. You can um, call me Chess. Okay, fine. The Zerg formerly known as Chessy, I don't think has much play here because <laughs> his economy is not strong enough to get out a big amount of Ultralis, and you can't really like win with the swarm against that many times. It's like the Terran just backs out, radiates all your defilers, comes back around too, and you're just I think is what's going to happen, right? Yeah. And the tanks represent a considerable threat that like needs to be dealt with. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I have the defiler though. Oh, this lurker backs down really nice though, but there is bunkers set up. Very nice play by Sylvian to get this set up. Yep, Very and beautiful. vessels are at my natural. Oh, but that first swarm. Oh. Here are all these sketch, man. Why are they still in the third? They could be doing a lot right now. You're right. <laughs> You're right. That defiler is full energy. I'm going to get another Just swarm, off, the swarm dude. dude. I'm going to, dude. Oh. Right. I did. Barely. It's kind of misplaced. But that's Yo, I can't. You know what? Can I cast my own game now? You're you, yeah, go I, on, go on. Yeah, so look at this go sick on, lurkers on the high ground. The fucking stink lurker flank over there. Oh my god, look at how sick those swarms are. The cauliflower is beautiful. I love it. These marines are just throwing into me. Look at my my opponent. He doesn't know, have, have a clue what he's doing. Oh, but actually the swarm expired and I don't have a defiler. So <laughs> it's looking bad. There's the scourge. There we got one. Love it, man. Oh, not the pilot. Yeah. We have no energy. Same range of tank. That's fair. Uh, does he have another radiate? He does not quite, unfortunately. I always yeah. said that macro is slipping a lot at home. SCRBN's still only on four barracks. Dude, the vessel's pumping, though. it's cool, because my macro is slipping equally. It's all good. So it's just balanced. Yeah, it's pretty balanced here. We're actually, we okay, were a good match. Swarm down here, though. These tanks could get cleaned up pretty easily with one more swarm. Oh, damn. That's a big deal. Oh, actually, no, it is only Lings, though, and tanks can kind of deal with that. Oh no, the Scourge though. And we'll take out another vessel. Uh, I didn't clone it well enough. And Marines were there. So, I love this so, drone Tanks here. negated for now. Let's just see, continuing to fight, but still no prospect of a fourth base. So yeah. I think the next push is just gonna be even harder. Then again, like I said, Macro really sticking yeah. this idea and really needs to add more barracks here because four barracks production is not really enough. Dude, look at my bank. I feel so sad. Why am I floating? That's a lot of gas. Thousand and two thousand. That's a lot of yeah, gas. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start switching to ultras here. Well, you might as well just make a big bunch of ultras then, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're I mean, you're right. Needs four bases. You're right. You're right. <laughs> okay, Sanchez is coming up here, but I don't see any scourge. Could they go for an eraser here? I think they And dude, could. I'm at a forty-one supply to one hundred and fourteen, right now. You're at seventy supply, but yeah. Wait. Dude, I have replay bug then. Really? I'm at 70? I see 41. Oh. I'm replay bug. Oh, no, bugged. replay bug. I'm replay bug. So what's happening at the 12 o'clock for you right now? A whole bunch of local Nothing is happening. Nice. Nothing is happening. Oh. oh. You hate to That's see That's all right. We can rehost and just, like, fast forward, right? 14 minutes so we on the at... clock. 14 minutes on the yeah, clock. Yeah, fine, fine. Let's oh. go do it. I have the real... I played this game. I have the replay. Yeah, so you should know. It happens in laggy games? You're goddamn right it does. <laughs> No, 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 but it wouldn't be bug for both of us then. The bug here is that we're seeing different things in the host replay, not that the replay's broken. So, okay. I didn't think it's related to the replay itself at all. Okay. Chessie couldn't even tell it was a replay bug because it usually plays so bad. No, dude, like, I, <laughs> I had a theory. I, <laughs> no, I, I, I started to feel... No. I started. I started to feel like that's not normal. I don't remember four thousand. I don't re remember that much. Okay, like that. Was like you've got like ten hour drones just sitting there, and you've only got like yeah. Four no, total. It, that it, looks normal. No, it. Oh, okay. dude. Okay, it looks let's play the same. from here. Play from here. Yep. So you're telling me this is not legit right now? Or this is good. It looks pretty legit. I I think this is. 
unbugged. Because I oh, remember cleaning no. up like this. Not sure. That though. second swarm here, because... that swarm there, that didn't exist in my uh, last replay. This bug here. Oh, so... I'm just going to fast forward until 14 minutes, alright? No, we're at 13. Oh, fastest. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah we'll go to 14. Soon. Yeah, this so is. So far, it looks the same. Th so what's your supply? At? No, to me it looks normal. I'm at 68, 66. Okay, good, good. Yeah, yeah, we're good, we're good. To me it looks right. normal again because I remember doing right, this. Then. Dude, I, yeah, only 2k, 2k, only 2k, 2k. <laughs> not so bad, only 2k, 2k. Still looks oh. bugged. It's not bugged. I'm just bad. Okay, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Christ! I knew that some shit was gonna. You know what? Oh. Look, man, we didn't have to cast your replay. We could have been like, oh, well, we don't want to cast our own game. <laughs> and don't worry, mine, mine are not going to be very impressive either. Nice eraser coming in here, though. The like, eraser. It's a great force that came out of this night, but none of it helps against the scientists, unfortunately. Yep. Um, oh, man, these lings coming in way too early. Yeah. Uh, with another swarm, though, you could get in there and take that out. Oh, yeah. But all the drones are already dead. But, I mean, who needs drones? you got that much money in the bank, right? Yeah. Yeah, tell me about it. Um... I think I do another swarm here in a second. Okay. He backs well, up. Well, I'm waiting. Well, very smart of him because he knows the drones will dead. He doesn't really have to overstay his welcome. And I mean, if he keeps his force alive, he's got a lot of potential. Look at the natural. There's nothing defending there. If he swings around to the natural right away, he maybe realize some reinforcements. I don't, I don't know, know why. You, that. you know, you watch your own replays. You're like, what are you doing, man? Come on, man. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. I do that while I'm playing, though. I don't even need the replay. I'm just yeah. like sitting there, like, what am I? What even is this game? Okay. So I'm establishing the fourth final. Fourth command center coming up. Well, I mean, Terran's on par of you, and that's not what you want. Hey, spending that bank, though. Seven Ultralis coming out. Adrenal. Yeah. You probably should have got Adrenal as soon as your hive finished, but whatever, man. Um, yep. But yeah, there is going to be a bit of an ultra sudden like appearance, though. But there are a bunch of mines there. I would really like to see us go in and get more out of the map. It looks like he will do just that. Um, but yeah, you don't, you don't want like, the Zerg to get this close before the mines start doing something. Right. And, uh, you know, I, I feel good. Okay. Like, I feel not bad. I see that he's going to be mecking eventually, or, the, like, vultures and mines are going to start to be a problem. I don't think he's going to commit to a full mech, which I think he's not just mecking mines, which yeah. is a nice move. Well, that's but what I, I thought. Mech, I guess. I thought that maybe he's mech transitioning. Yeah. Um, Keeping up this vessel production, and he finally is adding more barracks slowly. I will say, like, the main thing I don't like messing up again is the slow pace, which is, like, you could probably have, like, 10 right now and be producing mm -hmm. from him quite happily. Uh, wait, he's going for double armory, so is he going to do a liftoff here and switch? Surely he is with double armory. Whoa, this is too crazy for me. I would have thought if you went for the double eBay, you wouldn't do the switch. Like, you just stick with what you've got, especially with only one factory at this point in the game. But he seems intent to with make double armory. Some point. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe when you secure another main, you yeah. get a bunch of tanks there. I don't know, it's interesting. So, okay, so here comes this scary force. Conga line. Shut down this fifth base, yeah. Across the mid. Those irradiates are the biggest waste of energy I've ever seen. Oh my <laughs> god. That is so pointless. Oh, the Oshilists are shy, though. Come on, Oshilists, don't be shy. They're getting in there. No no attack upgrade and plus two armor for the Terran, but it is just an overwhelming number. And the Zerg used all that energy on Hydralisks and Overlords. Yep. I mean, sorry, the Terran used the energy. He just irradiated another Overlord! Yeah. Okay, so it cleans up that army so easily, but Terran has this massive bank. And I don't think a counterattack has any potential here because of all these mines. Um, although, as I said before, he could have laid them further away. But I think yeah. SCRVN can just come out with a force here, and it's kind of up to you to see to kind of see, I hang felt, on and recover. Yeah, I felt really good after cleaning up that bio army here, but then the mines made me sad. And there's yeah. one down. And, and, and this stream of sadness, the trail of tears, so to speak, <laughs> of my <laughs> ultras coming across the way oh, here. Oh, and these bunkers too. Yeah. Bunkers actually pretty good against ultralists. Like, I really thought that maybe I would have a chance, but he's just doing Terran stuff. Like, he's so defensive. Well, you got no drones at your fourth. Like, during this, you need to be droning up. Truth. That's true. Yeah. You're speaking truth to power right now, man. You know? Are you power? I, you I'm know? streaming this. I mean, this is my... Yeah, you're the streamer. You know, you know I, I mean, I can't believe I lost to a Terran that had 5,000 bank. Like... <laughs> Well, he has expanded quite fast. Yeah, he's putting but hand it's like, like, if he didn't have a bank, oh boy. What am I doing? I know, but I, I, I should be taking over the map. I should have every base I would say your main in the northern right hemisphere. You drone up these bases. Yeah, like it's just sitting there. Yeah. Drone's bad, but you could have transferred, say, maybe put a couple of locusts there with small, I don't know. Um, yeah. At least put a nidus. Yeah, you're right. But yeah, right. also you can send links out trying to keep control of the map as well. 
because at the moment you you have like decent vision around the place, but no map control at all. That swarm is nice. That lurker swarm attack is very nice. Terra can't really do anything about that. He does have a decent number of vessels though to clean up eventually, and a good amount of energy on them too. Mm -hmm. Oh man, that one vulture. See if you built a Nidus. Oh, here's where I just I'm just gonna get depressed, Neblime. Like you, <laughs> you're gonna turn into my Terran therapist right now because I became a sad, sad chessy. <laughs> in the next 10 minutes. Pretty yeah. sad. Oh, wow. I can't believe that they didn't get any vessels there. I'm sorry, but that's kind of amazing. Uh, yeah, I think, like, these attacks aren't bad, but I think, like, putting on all this pressure is the wrong move when you really just need to build your economy. Although this one's getting a lot done. Maybe maybe it will pay off. Yeah, it's but looking yeah, good, still right? Still no drones mining at the fort. You need to be paying attention to that. The problem is you're prioritizing these attacks, but you're not growing your economy at all. At all times, you should be like looking after that economy. This is a mistake I see a lot. Uh, yeah. And people kind of like, okay, I don't need to grow economy anymore. You know what I mean? I and know. Just stop expanding. Or I had, stop, like, I had a feeling like I can just kill him. I'm just gonna squash him now. You know, and it's not true. Yeah. And like, you have enough money that you could have done both. Though. You could have made like one hydra here and like kept draining while this was going on. This is so. I hate this. I hate this. This, like, I finally figured it out and realized, and I'm like, oh my god. Oh, dude, that that a drone tried to make what I assume would be a oh nice yeah game, oh yeah you so bet it you bet the... it you bet it did and he did not make it so swarm though uh, down at the six. oh man that irradiate though gonna murder so many SCVs okay they get away that could have been so bad but hey I mean this fourth phase is going down so you're pushing the terror down a bit but as I've already said you're in economy not going with this and look this like little ram chapel force gonna come up here and deny that top right there. Uh, I think taking the nine would have been a good move here. Go back to the nine, yeah. We'll take it as well as the top right. Man, this yeah. ultra is so low, but still going. I mean, if you take out this riddle only, though, he'd have to be down to his back, but that is significant. Nice swarm. You have number one. Just, just see, you need enough, another one. I know, I need to just consume see. something, just and see. that's actually consume really Consume the other defiler, you don't need it. No, oh. it's so hard to do that, though. Like, it's defilers well, are... On top, like you can't defilers are hard to control, and I really... I wish that people would understand. It's very I it's easy. hard I'm just saying to consume that's what you needed stuff. to do, all right? Yeah. I never said I never said geez, just see, it's so easy. I could do it with my clothes. I just said you need another swarm. I know. Okay, so the top right base is dead. Still Look, minus man, 12 and this middle only I'm is healthy. I'm still sad about this. You know, like <laughs> like this is like lemon and salt in the wound together. Oof. Okay, so he's retaking the 6 o'clock, and the middle only did not quite go down. You know, you could try bringing out the queen, go for the infest. Oh no, the rays are going down, but there are scares to deal with this time. Oh, got oh, him. Nice kite back though. Oh, he got Got him. Got him. Easy peasy. Yeah, I gotta say, SMVN's main edge in this game is just he's relentlessly expanding. His mining from yet another location at 3 o'clock, yeah. Um, he's not spending all the money, but at least he has it in the bank to spend one day. Um, yep. but you still have a considerable amount of money to play with here, it's not over by yeah. any means. I actually did not fully know about the 3 o'clock base for quite a bit. Yeah. Um, if I had known, I would have tried to shut this down, but... Wow, that bunker position intrigues me. Why would you put it back there? Like, couldn't the lurker just come in and kill everything? My what position? Sorry? Look at the bunker position at the 3 o'clock, that intrigues oh, me. Oh, that bunker in the back? Yeah, I'm not sure about yeah. that, but... Oh well. Fascinating. And bottom I mean, left. if like Ling Ultra is trying to come in, it's kind of good because it's so far back. Oh wow, he's putting so many bunkers here. He does not want to lose. Eleven Ultras morphing. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Eleven Ultras plus some Ling to Father. I don't know. That could do a lot of damage. Yeah, dude. I mean, I'm I... looking at the front of SURBN's base, and is there really that much between his production and uh, and you? Okay, so he's lifted off his new base, by the way. Double armory still pumping. I'm just wondering when these factories going to go down. He's finally taking this bottom left main. I think he's going to put a bunch of factories there and set up tanks. This drone, like, oh, can I expand here, Terrence? Like, yeah, like, oh, I'll go bottom left, right? And then, uh, oop, I discover he's trying to go bottom right. <laughs> well, you've got 11 ultras to deal with that. Yeah. That drone's doing his best. I'll take down this command center. Yeah, take that. That's that drone right now. Doing his best. Okay, so the Ultra Swarm is out. Where's the Defiler? It's near my net. It's walking slowly. It's in the middle yeah. of the map. Yep. Uh, I need to pull back before this Defiler's here, although then again, this is enough Ultras. You can sort of smell all this. Yep. Oh, that's so many bunkers, though. 
Please bunk it up, dude. So, like, if you look at this, you're like, oh, Zerk, Zerk's not yeah, looking too Zerk's bad. Yeah, crushing it. Yeah. Yeah, but then look at his bank, dude. Look at his bank. Unless you I get know. on top of the production, does it really matter how much I... you kill? But then you get oh. in there, the Defiler's still alive. If you get in there with a swarm, look how many Ultras there are. Oh, I know. This. Oh, oh, I the know. Mine! Okay, he doesn't get the Defiler. Okay, he puts an A-swarm. Oh, there goes the. But then I got irradiated on my defiler. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's what this is for, I guess. And then. Oh, well, it's a nice block on the ramp. That block, block and free, this but ramp optimizing block. Optimizing damage there, yeah. It's and he can so annoying. Him, so. And then he dematrix oh, the tank. Oh, dematrix, so sick. Oh. So sick. And now a bunch of marines are coming out. They will probably be able to clean this up because all those ultras are pretty good. And also, a plus three attack to only plus two armor. Tank finally goes down. But yeah, that'll be the end of the attack, and I don't know. That was a big chunk of money, but you did deny the bottom left. I just did another pretty big face palm there because I'm just watching myself die in real time. <laughs> and hey, it's you're set. taking another base. But yeah, this 9 o'clock you should have taken ages ago, I reckon. Um, but hey, the, the bottom left is denied. I think if you put all your forces to the 3 o'clock, you deny it. Uh, but going into these linked here, I don't know. I mean, fully upgraded bio rallying out, I think sort of crushes things. That's all things, though. 3-3 three, three against 2-2. Two, two. I mean, is yeah. that enough? Nerf ah, Marines, yes dude. Nice Nerf Marines. <laughs> wow, d Matrix amazing there. Really well done. Uh, uh, I think spells here. <laughs> dude, I'm pissed. What the fuck? Well, I'm surprised you're so low on minerals. I've got like quite a few drones mining. I feel like my macro was pretty good. Like I was spending my money, yeah. but that's always the thing. Like, are you even making well, enough? Like, are you making at the... this point? You're pretty doomed because you're out of gas. Basically, you had a decent gas bank, but it's all spent now. What can you do? Again, I would say like taking the not taking the nine o'clock is critical. Yeah, yeah, really, I mean, it is a bummer. Some ultras. I got you like really five here. Region. I mean, it can clean up this army, but like, what's going to happen to the vessels, right? You're going with gas, really scared. The vessels are pretty rough for me, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Well, clean up marines, though. Yeah, these lings are just getting thrown away at this point. Well, a decent attack on the bottom, like the six o'clock here, but he has these bunkers, dude. This is the most fortified location ever. All of these bunkers have something in them. None of them are empty. Yeah. Yeah, he did good. At putting guys in the bunkers, for sure, for sure. Dark Swarm would probably help. Yeah, Dark Swarm's a good spell in the Zerg arsenal. Yeah. Okay, well, honestly, at this point, <laughs> I'm, I'm happy calling it that you can't win because you have no gas left, and I don't think you can really end up taking a... You're comfortable calling it right now? Really? Yes. You think so? Yeah, no. Yeah, I think so. Let's see how you can win. I mean, what if I took Straight another? Tell, what if I took how. another gas base? You know, like the nine o'clock. Take that but base. But how would you do that? How he's not going to let you. Yeah. He, if he lets you, fine. But that's like saying, you know, if my opponent let me win, I would win. Well. But like, assuming he keeps on his macro, and he's still like mining from everywhere. Look, um, you're you right. Stand out, dude. We're watching my heartbreak in real time. I'm sorry. I got to tell it how it is. Look, he's the already heart, seen the Oh, that just—it's just breaking. Did he notice though? I don't think he noticed. So he's, he's leaving it. Just fortunate yeah. for you. He's not mining with all of his SCVs at the three o'clock even. That's the radiator's gone now. Yeah. Wait, no, there's overlords. Why is he keep radiating the overlords? Ah. Uh. Yeah, I'm not sure, but he's got enough vessels. Like, oh, I don't... that D matrix. Wow, that D matrix didn't last long at all. Jesus, how much damage do? Uh, are pretty good. Do I have 3-3 three, three now? I have 3-3. Three, three. Dude, you have so much money, you can make like 24 buybacks and come over here and kill this. Pretty good. But yeah, there's another wave coming out. Yep, Scourge I see that coming wave. in though, this could be good. Nice, I... three vessels go down. Yeah. Still a significant number left though. I split what I could, but I'm feeling a little starved and now I'm realizing, you know, in hindsight, well, he is max. Well, the going up. The 9 o'clock is going up uncontested though, so yeah, that's potentially a lifeline for you. Could yeah, my... these vessels, what are you going to do about all of that? Could my heart break into pieces faster? Yeah. <laughs> um, if you get a good play on the vessels and you can muter them or something, uh, what are you swarming for, dude? There's nothing left. 
Dude, I just... The, my defiler got irradiated, so I thought I should put something down before he dies. Fair enough. Yeah. Did you research plague? Um, plague. Plague. Oh, yeah, plague. you know what? That swarm helps a lot. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, that no, swarm right. helps I a have lot. Question. That swarm yeah, that swarm helps. helps a lot. What's up, Neb? Look at Get that out swarm. Of the class, yeah, you know what? Get out of here. You're not going to yep. break my All heart. Right. My heart is resilient because people love me on my team, <laughs> Samyang Fire. And I may lose, but I tried, you know? I mean, is it GG for Zerg position? Like, I still feel like I have a lot going. Look at the nine. I mean, unless you, yeah, if you set up the nine, then you've got a chance. Yeah. That's like the only thing you've got going for you. Yeah. So I feel like Terrence has to like send his hand over there and like, you know, squat it down and then you're out of the game. Are you but kidding me that Marine took oh. out that sunk? Are you actually, oh Look my. Look at those vultures though. The vultures get into the, the nine and I think that's probably the end. Ooh, Lin's gonna try. Dude, these vultures are pretty well upgraded, okay, that's a lot more links though. So you know what, maybe you can hold it, but so many drones went down already. And now he's securing the bottom left. Yeah, I mean, even, he's taking out the base is not even that important, dude, so I don't know. Yeah, it's rough. I mean, you fought back as well as you could. But ultimately, ultimately I think the a turn just drawing too much for these bases. Like, it's kind of like an insurmountable amount of stuff he has. Yeah, the mineral, then. the three o'clock, I think the three o'clock was the clutch moment where him securing that just set him up for what he wanted to do oh next. Oh my god, look how many mines he has in here. Do you I know. Think it's like a recall it's or something? It's insane. This is why, this, dude, this, this, what you're looking at right now, look at this. This I'm is looking. Tisagi in the bottom, like those, <sighs> Mines, Come on, need, man. mines ha need to cost something. I think 100 minerals per mine. I think they cost 75 minerals. Just get a free vulture with them. Well, no, okay, no, each mine costs 25 minerals. Then. No, that's not true though. Speed vultures are no, so vulture, good. Vultures are free. Mine. You're expensive. obfuscating what I'm really saying, <laughs> and that mine to place a mine should cost you money. That's how I feel. That's how I feel. Okay, well, if it costs money, can I have infinite mines per vulture? Um. Maybe if with an upgrade. How about the upgrade? Needs, yeah. yeah, fine. I'm fine with that. Okay. All right, I'm fine with that too. Saying, let's uh, email. Let's well, how email much Grant cost? Davies. How much would they cost? I how think. How much would the mine cost? I think mine should cost 100 minerals each. Uh, okay, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I, I, I That's my though. opinion. You know. Oh jeez. Okay. And here's where I knew that I was kind of done. Well. He's maxed, but I don't know where all his units are. He's this tiny army. Yeah. Bunch of vessels. He's got a lot of SCVs. Too many SCVs, yeah. He's got too He's many. He's sacrificed some. And a lot of vessels. At Why home. are you retreating from like seven marines, dude? I am a scaredy boy. I thought I was going to lose the game. Oh, jeez. I think you're going to lose the game. Yeah. Can I spoiler you or no? Do you want to find out what happens? I mean, I think I don't think you need to spoil me. I think it's like known at this point. You know, <laughs> it, it is known. Yeah. Yeah. How can you possibly win? Through dude, he's a radiating individual drone. I know. Two hundred supply to sixty. Yeah. He has five thousand minerals. If you win this, you're a complete god. No need for the grand finals. Just, just give it to me. Right just crown yeah. Chessie, the best Zerg yeah, in the crown CPL. Crown just Chessie, crown, yeah. crown me, Chessie, the best Zerg to win this game. Um, yeah, but you're not going to. Like, there's no way. Yeah. Hey, you know what you there's can do, no Neb? What? Just hit what? the faster times two here, and we'll just kind of, you know, scoot to the inevitable conclusion. All right. Well, normally I wouldn't, but it's since it's your own game, fine. Yeah. I mean, go ahead, because we're just going to see some nasty irradiates at like 9 o'clock, which is very yeah, sad. Yeah, some vessels for that. But he has 7k, 3k in the bank. It's true. And I'm counting larva, right? Like, every larva is 50 minutes. He really needs to minerals. send some, like, SCVs yeah. over to, like, die. Because, like I said, he's maxed, but, like, he has a lot of dudes in bunkers as well that I feel like he could sacrifice. Just get a whole bunch of tanks. Yeah. I mean, he's, he's treating okay with what he has. And then I threw some lurkers away. Bummer. 
I mean, they kind of got some stuff done. It wasn't like a total loss. But yeah, if they had a defiler with it, it would have been much better. Remember, gas is infinite, even though you're mining it very slowly. Yeah, but look at these D-Matrix Vultures, like, killing my... Th yeah. Feels bad. Yeah, that bottom left is so fortified. Yeah, the bottom... I kind of want to see a Doom drop land in all these mines. <laughs> I know, I right? See it. But all those mines are a waste, because you're never going to get in there, right? Oh, that uh, D-Matrix already... <laughs> I know, they're even D-Matrixing me now. Like... Well, just... what I'm seeing is interesting. Like, my impression is that SCRBN's a very defensive player, right? He's not, like, trying to build up a new force tank. He's just trying to fortify, like, every location on the map, and it works. Dude, I mean... I don't mean... think it's, like, a less effective way to play, but it does take longer. Dude, it's in the Vietnamese nature. Remember Vietnam? We tried to get in their oh, ass, and we got true. fucking owned. Like, they... Yeah, it's true. Literally, they, like... They had a great SimCity. They map. really had an excellent SimCity in, in the yeah, Vietnam War. Yeah, the terrain We got, we got really owned well. on that one, for sure. Yeah. Okay, so I GG here pretty soon, don't worry. Okay. Okay, <laughs> yeah. say so. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> don't worry. That was a long one. It was a long game, oh, 36 the scratch, though. Oh. I mean, worth staying in just for that satisfaction. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, he takes both of them names, like, oh. And then these Goliaths start walking in here. I mean, yeah, he has so much money, he should probably just, like, max on battle cruises or something. Like, I'm at, yeah, like, oof. Oof. 14, 15,000 minerals banked. Capital G, G. <sighs> I was really interested. That defense, yes, yeah, the record says sick. That defensive playstyle is very interesting. Because it's interesting. Play, like, it's very fish. interesting. Yeah. Don't you think? Because normally you don't see people set up like that many bases with so many bunkers and such. Normally it's like, okay, you're either going full mech and sort of like putting mines and tanks around to block the zerg and you're half the map, you take the bases, or you're going SK and you're sort of expanding a lot slower and just putting a lot of pressure. On. It's very interesting. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. So, uh, 102 SCRVN. You've. One zero. I mean, okay, let's go back to the moment with the Ultralist, though. Like, there was a period of time where it was looking a little scary for Terran, and I denied the six, but right? He still had 5,000 minerals at that point. Like, the point, from the point where you lost your third, it, yeah. was, it was a downward trend because your economy is always going to be behind you. So he got his third with a very quick timing. Yeah. And he just kind of kept the link from there economically. Again, it's kind of unorthodox. It's not what you normally see in TBZ. Normally, like, Terran wants to put the pressure on expand a little slower. But he just saw the opposite. And I actually didn't know about the 3 o'clock, like, soon enough. So that was rough. That was rough. This guy's representing. Yeah, dude, SCR Vietnam. Vietnam. He is representing, so I'll give him that. Um, game 2. All right. So, it's on White House. Yes, it is. Of White Island TBZ. So, my plan was oh, uh, all in. Was my plan on White Out? I see. What kind? If I lose the first one, speedling, speedling all in. Um, okay. Good luck. Because I didn't. I, I thought about the ramp, defending the ramp. I, I don't know. I just. I felt. I just. So here's the thing. I was so angry. <laughs> Like, right now, I'm literally like... Well, because of the lag, or like, just the game? Well, too? the lag was rough. Like, we had turn rate 8 extra high, and, you know, the drop screen was coming up intermittently when he said his internet was fucked up. So, I'm thinking, I'm just going to all in him. I wanted out, and... Um, Fair enough. Yeah. Um, well, speedling all in is a quick way to do it, I guess. Yeah. I thought he was going to proxy me, so I'm send, I'm scouting for proxies. Interesting. Why would you think that after the first game? Because he played super defensive that whole game. Did you just think Whiteout because, was a good map for it? No, Whiteout resembles the jungles of Vietnam. He could be hiding in the trees or something. You know, I don't like... think it snows in Vietnam, dude. <laughs> this is Same. basically a recreation of the Vietnam War. <laughs> U.S. versus Oh, yeah, Vietnam. with the alien yeah. insects and the yeah. freaking, like, okay, like, drugged up marines. Actually, that <laughs> yeah, 
We need the history teacher to come in here and tell us what's up. Did, um, did they ever drop radioactive ice chips on, like, Cambodian peasants or something? I wouldn't be surprised. I, you know what? I wouldn't be surprised. America's fucked up. So They basically just did a razor on the civilians. I scouted him. I scouted yeah. him pretty early. Very nice. So it's going to be a hatch first type thing, okay. I'm going to hatch first, yep. Yeah. Because yeah. he's a speed wing I wasn't sure if you meant, like, you're going to open nine for speed. And just, I, no, oh, I like... Oh, dude! How what? does he... Two racks in base? Two what? X in base, yeah. Without scouting? That's kind of crazy. So I, Zerg is just going hatch first and plays a macro game. It's not very good, quite it's frankly. It's not good. Yeah, well, I wish I would have played a macro game. Yeah, well, you you could react to this. Like, you can... So, I would say from here, you're just like, okay, you get one creep colony immediately and just keep an eye on him when he's moving out and just add more. Like, you just have to hold, like, a, you know, a steam timing and then you'll be ahead because he's a like, um, Look, man. I'm looking. I didn't do that. Okay, I, I like. Oh, spoilers! I'm sorry, spoilers, but I was so tilted. Like, I just thought I'm gonna make links and kill him. Mm. I'm gonna make links and kill him. I'm just gonna kill him with links. That's all. Literally, all the, the only thing in my head right now. Well, I would say, generally speaking, this is pretty good against links because you have more marines, right? Yep. And oh, remember, he's not taking um, gas. What is he doing? The Terran who set the wall up in our earlier series on on mm -hmm. this one was that fake promise against Bojack. Um, uh, the wall of Marines and SCV. I mean, mean. or uh, SCV bunker depot forms like a little three. Oh, yeah, little yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Um, Comsat aside, that was a pretty effective. Comsat aside. Yeah. It, um, it was perfectly good. You do need to block some of the gaps because things can slip through there. But even if you don't, right. it still like feels slip through slower, so it's still very helpful. Yeah, for um, sure. I, well, we're gonna see. You're gonna feel my heart wow, break. Wow, this is so time. weird. So I think SCRVN expected like a four pool or a nine because he didn't go with Gasser Academy here. He just went for the two racks in base. So maybe he was expecting of a greed like three gas for four. Pool, I sent my drone really early. Cheese. I sent my yeah. drone super early and checked for proxies. But he started the second racks before he uh, before your drone got there, right? He was already committed. To no, that. it was one. Oh, okay. So maybe it was a one bear. Like, Shit, it's a four pool. That's right. And panicked, right? Yeah, that's oh, that's really what occurred, I think. So okay, he's playing smart, right? And look at this wall here. Like speed. I don't like that depot position. That depot needs to be up one. Well, okay, no, I shouldn't say that because I see pros always leave this gap, but I don't really understand that because Marines can still fit, and it just means links get easier. But well, when I play, I don't leave that gap. I would put the depot against the bunker, but I can't say it's bad because pros do it as well. Yeah, speed's almost halfway done now, so. You can see that I'm gonna kind of be thinking like, oh man, I'm gonna go kill him. I'm gonna go kill him. If you wanted to do speeding, why don't you, why don't you keep my gas? Yeah, so why not just stop and just make him lose? I wanted a contingency plan as well. Okay, okay. So you're gonna get you know. behind this. Um, we're gonna see. We are gonna see. Yeah, I'll tell you right now. Mostly it is links on my game plan, but um, okay. There is a contingency as well. There's a contingency. I mean, I'm just looking at this marine count versus this link count. It doesn't look so good. Like I feel like uh, you could have pulled off gas earlier and dedicated to the links way better. Even if you do want to have a contingency, then you start money gas as soon as you go, and hopefully then the yeah. just slip down. I, don't know. I pulled one. I pulled one. So and I made a layer. So yeah. we'll see. Um, links. I mean, though, like I already said, when you see he's open two racks. Uh, or anything else, and then this kind of this whole setup here, like I just can't get in there like i'm gonna lose yeah. all my links no i think like, it's wise to not attack that was definitely a good scene. yeah um and he pulls the stvs now i mean he's not really positioning them properly but they are kind of there they're but at least just, there he goes for it anyway no he doesn't no no, no you can't do you will just get wrecked i know that i can't so i'm gonna hang out and well you have rest. the map control you do have map control so you can try and go for like a third base with lurkers here or something and like if he ever leaves to try and deny you can back that stack why do you keep sending him in was that a rally Sending what? You said a couple more links in to die. Oh, it, it, it was a rally. Yeah, it was a bad rally. Okay, we do see the hydrogen coming up. Uh, okay. So yeah, the, the dangerous time is when he gets out of the map with steam, you're going to be a bit behind. Yeah, If you can I get lurkers on a ramp, and like the sun comes at your natural, you can potentially delay. I mean, once you get to hive, anything can happen. I mean, maybe lurker drops are good here because of this high ground. I don't know. Because you could kind of land there and then run down, I guess. But no, why bother just land next to the minerals? Okay, we do see like aspect coming up. 
No Mantras as of yet. So I'm just wondering here, will you go for a third base or are you just going to sit on two? Because you can just commit to like a big local wing attack, I suppose. Dude, I'm just a sad person. Right now. Hey, look, I, I'm, just, up, I'm just a sad person. That's alright. Yeah. Well, you said it was going to be mostly me casting, that's okay. So, like I said, yep. we have two Rex Tech coming up, which is interesting, because uh, you didn't really scout what you're up to. Um, but if it is a, like, a local all-in, this is definitely helpful. Uh, helpful against Mutus as well. Scans are available. There we go. And he just scanned, scanned me. So he just scanned me, sees yep. the lurker. Yep. So, okay. it's tough. So I'd like to see more bunkers from him right now, I think, because he knows he's ahead, right? He just needs to survive. Well, here it goes. There we go. Very nice. And I think a tank will be out before too long with siege mode, but there is going to be a window, I think, before tanks slash siege mode where the lurkers can get in here. And there's limited detection for the Terran because he used both his scans. I didn't see any turrets going up yet. Yep, aspect just finished, so. That did he get marine range already? He probably did. Wow, I double eBay super early this game, by the way. That's interesting. I think he did get marine range. He's got stim and range. Yeah, it makes sense. I, I would expect he had range, but I just wasn't sure. Because, I mean, no offense to tier 2 players, but I do see people forget a lot. Yeah. No, he's pretty good. I mean, I have to give. I tip my hat to him because. I think that his reactions and his play is definitely the Sim City here. Like it thwarted me, it thwarted my plans. So um, yeah, yeah, no, it was a good defense, guys. Although honestly, I don't think one bunker at the front is enough. Dedicated to lurker attack. Yeah. Uh, okay, so the lurkers are out, but they need to get across the map pretty smart, uh, quick, smart, I should say, because the tanks almost out. Siege mode not far behind. Said so quick, smart. Yep. What? Pretty quick smart? Is that not an, is that not an expression in America? Yeah, what it, you do something what? quick smart, you do it quickly. Quick smart? Yeah, quick Is it smart. both intelligent and quick? No. It's just quick it's smart. It's just quick. It's just quick. So why don't you say get there quick? You say quick smart. Well, it's not enough emphasis. Oh, get there quick smart. Okay, quick smart. Otherwise, siege mode's gonna shit on you and it looks man, like siege mode is I, I love this Australian shit, man. This is so good. Okay, but the lurkers are going in. Oh. The wings can sneak through and target the tank, maybe. Okay, how many scans do you go? He's only got two scans. I actually I thought mean, I felt okay about this right now, actually. Ah, uh, but the tank in the back is not going down. There is another bunker, but there's not that much in the bunker. These lurkers get here and the turret goes down, which it probably will in a second. Yeah. Oh, what is this sneaky second group? What are they doing up there? I don't there? know. I think he what thought a heck? drop. He expected yeah, a drop, sense, I think. I but oh man, that ramp is destroying his own moves right now. But the tank survives. Those marines... Okay, targeting combat, I question there, because these marines are getting in and killing me. But hey, there's still plenty of locusts left. Um, yeah. There's a siege mode tank and the turret. Uh... Is that in range? That's not in range. Need to move those locusts on top of that. No, you're too far away, why'd you burrow there? You had it, man, you're just burrowing too far away. I know, I know, and now look But hey, that still did significant damage. That did significant yeah. damage. Equal supplies, equal supplies, equal supplies right now. I okay, thought... but what is this third, though? Why would you take that one? I was I panicking. Understand. I'm not sure. Okay. You do know there's the one, like, uh, down and left, and there's the one kind of north of your main as well, or both good options. Uh, frankly, or south of his main. frankly, no, because I did not practice whiteout enough. Well, that's your own fault. I know it you is. Gotta practice that much. I mean, I Okay, Vessel's coming did. out. Vessel's coming out. Push this back. Um, the hive is not finished. So, I think that's the other push across the map. These wings are a total waste. Total waste, you are right. Yeah, not achieving anything with those. Could have been drones, man. It's like, it's now, tough. Still hold it. It's tough to watch your own game because I see that and I'm like, yeah, you're yeah. right. You know, you're right. But I didn't feel that. Like, I didn't think of that and I didn't feel that in the game. Yeah. You can see now that this third is actually just like, you know, walking dead basically. Like, as soon as SCRVN gets his shit together and comes across the map, that third is going down. Mm -hmm. That group on the high ground, though, that was such a surprise. I was like, what are they doing? Mm -hmm. He thought... Excuse me, he thought for sure I was going to do the drop play. Um, for sure. Madino is now hosting my stream for 30... V what? Damn. F a plus 30 plus viewers? Oh, shit, dude. Damn. Um, I'll drink to that. Let me get a white claw. Nice. Welcome in, new viewers who just came on. This is uh, the coach people. League. 
casting the quarterfinals. Dude, I think he's in a clan. Is that is that the cool. um, is that Rev clan? Maybe Rev. I don't know. I'm not sure, but wow. Thanks, man. So hey, we, appreciate that. We're casting Chessy himself, the other caster. I'm the Zerg here. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And that's uh, right, rough. I wonder if you could, like, hold Lurker to the side in the forest, because the sign also might be, like, you know, off to one side. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Interesting maybe. Um, it's this honestly... Game is just like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, this is a horror movie I mean, for me right now. <laughs> if you can get on top of that, oh, there's too many tanks. I guess they would shred. One, two, three, four, five tanks and a vessel. It's... Yeah. It's just been unfortunate that the fire timing. I reckon if, uh... This, this hatch was obviously somewhere else and could like borrow and unburrow to slow him down. Maybe you could like delay until the father comes out, maybe. Yeah. But with that many tanks, it's not easy. Yeah, I was pretty upset right now. I won't lie to you. I was feeling- Oh, but the counter attack! I didn't even oh, see that. Oh, counter attack with the lurkers. Oh. And it's again looking pretty potent, right? Damn, like... so many CVs going down. He's bringing his army back. Well, just see, you have no third base there. But if you can get the filer out, if the next attack comes in with the filer, it could be lethal. Oh, nice scan! There. That scan saves the game for him. Like, yeah. Like, seriously. He seems to have a scan, doesn't he? You need to stop targeting his commissars, man. They're not coming down anytime soon. Damn. So many tanks. He has. I didn't realize that he had double factory kind of tanks, but that's pretty decisive. Yeah, for sure, for sure. And with that, he's dude. Gonna... If you bought a queen, you could have. You know, I know it's a bit of a long shot, but if you bought a queen, you could have invested that. Dude, you know what? You know what's funny? I have literally never infested a Terran command center in my career. I've never done it I've in a real done game. It in 1v1. I've, I've never, never done, done it in a real game. And I, you know what? You've inspired me now. Ne Nebline, when we play, you need to look the fuck out for that queen <laughs> shit, dude. I'm coming for you on, for that. Dude, I reckon one queen, if you have the APN, it's not bad because you can, like, parasites and stuff or whatever. Yeah. And, like, it's like, yeah, you don't have to kill the CC, you just have to kill the center and then the queen finished off, so she kind of good. Oh, man, these workers. Oh, I know, that scan? The... That scan gets them? Oh, no, it's a vessel. A vessel say, comes. I thought that scan was out of... Yeah, and now this is an irresistible force about defilers. The consumer's almost done, but where are the defilers? None are built. Dude, um, yeah. No gas left, <laughs> yeah. unfortunately. Yeah, they're, they're, uh, it's tough. I mean, there's no gas to do it with, so, yeah. Feels yeah. bad. Terran's gonna barrel in here. I mean, he's taking a lot of damage from the sights that he didn't have to be. Yeah, there's enough tanks here, I think, to finish this off. 1 1 upgrades on those Marines. Didn't start plus 2 at any point, which is questionable, but yeah, not gonna matter. Ooh, ah. Oh, hey, Chesty, did you see those Marines? GG. GG. Damn. Well, good effort. Almost. Good almost effort. Out. There's a tank still. I mean. I, I, I didn't. I, f I have this feeling like I didn't play like terribly. Like some of my counters were pretty good. Like my strat game one, I almost I almost got him with the ultras. Yeah, <sighs> it, was, it was a good try.